Join us, Millie, John T, Milo, and Aspen, as we share our lives as Brits living in my country of birth, Singapore. We hope you enjoy our adventures as we find the extraordinary wonders in our normal everyday lives. Welcome, Welcome to, to Wonderland. We've just arrived, ready for our staycation. We got a little bit caught in the rain, so we're looking forward to getting in, checking out our room and getting dried off. Ready? machine here, Starbucks. Oh. As you may have realised, we are not at a fancy hotel, but we're at home. Uh, we decided that we we're going to have a staycation at home because actually we are so grateful for where we are and um, we thought it would be great to just enjoy where we are and not take it for granted and yeah, just have a, a couple of days at home to enjoy the facilities at our condo. I guess so, there's a lot of us in Singapore who are fortunate enough to have facilities at home and I wonder how many of us actually use them. I know that we don't take full advantage of it. So we're going to spend a couple of days just uh, having some fun at home. So here we are appreciating our own home and enjoying what we have here. One of the things that you love about hotel rooms is when you go in, everything is clean, the bed's made, you've got tiny little shampoos and conditioners. So we actually called in Service Hero and they came and they've cleaned our entire apartment top to bottom. It looks brilliant. We left little shampoo and conditioner bottles out and they've lined them all up for us to give us that real holiday kind of feel. We're just going to go uh, and have some dinner now downstairs. Uh, kids are pretty excited. Uh, it's actually really nice to be eating somewhere slightly different. It, even though we're still here in the building, um, the kids are really excited. It definitely, we do have this feeling of uh, being on a staycation, which is great. So, here we go. We're in the game room uh, here at the condo and we're just gonna have some dinner and play some games. Uh, so we've ordered some food from Clicker Food and Clicker Food, and you can order from their Facebook, whatever like that. They're pretty good to be honest, so um, yeah, go, do go check them out. Oh, thank you. Oh, hello, Korean mama bugger. Where's your pizza? Good, would you like some? <laughs> <laughs> I made a mess of my hands in the burger eating scenario, so I'm using no! a fork. But my hands are so greasy that I can't even like spike anything. <laughs> so I'm using a new no! technique. With my thumb on the top. I can get into my. No. You got a joke? Knock knock. Who's there? You. You who? You who? Family! Time and board game time over. We're going to head upstairs for a movie. When we did our stay home notice, we quite liked getting into bed and watching a movie, so we're going to turn our sofa into the sofa bed so that we can all sit together and watch a movie. It's 
been really nice, actually, this whole like having a staycation at home. The kids are just buzzing. I don't really know why. <laughs> They're just having such a good time and they loved having their dinner downstairs and sitting around like this having just time together, I guess. You know, the whole purpose of our channel is to find that extraordinary wonder in our ordinary lives and I think, you know, this is ordinary for us and we forget actually that we're in a really lucky, you know, fortunate, blessed, whatever word you want to use, um, situation. I'm really grateful with, uh, to Service Hero and what they've done. Uh, the house just looks amazing. Yep, we're going to turn in real soon as well and um, we'll see you guys in the morning. This morning we decided what we wanted for breakfast and then we um, went on to one of those apps uh, that you have like Food Panda or Deliveroo or Grab, I'm not going to say which one we used, uh, and decided to see what we wanted for breakfast and we picked some dim sum uh, which arrived within like half an hour and here we are having breakfast. <laughs> We've ordered from uh, Zira and Ija, who are two ladies who cook some of the most amazing food. Um, and we have got some spring rolls, like Bopia, but they have got some amazing things inside them. We've got some with rendang, some with um, satay, and for the kids we've got uh, chicken and cheese. Um, and then <clears throat> we've got these. What is it? Oh my goodness. What's that one? Rendang. You can taste the lemongrass. It's so good. The beef is so good. This little one's intolerant to peanut and we ordered our food from the lovely Ija and she's made a peanut free one so that Asman can uh, be involved as well and not miss out. I think she thinks it's good. Ish <laughs> roll is good. Uh, what I have here is a tahu bagadil. Uh, I think that's how you say it. Um, made by Zero. And it comes with this amazing uh, soy and chili sauce dip. I can feel it. <laughs> yeah. Well, the outside is like a tofu skin, and the inside is like a potato and beef. Um, we would call it like a bubble and squeak in the UK, but it is just delicious. And that that dipping sauce is unreal. It makes the whole thing like next level. Service Hero have been in again, which is really, really kind of them. They've come in, uh, sorted out the apartment again to make sure that it feels just like we're on staycation. We've come back from lunch by the pool. I guess a lot of people out here in Singapore would have a helper, but we don't have a helper. Um, and so for us, this is a complete luxury and it really does feel like we're on staycation. Um, and we're really, really grateful to Service Hero for coming in and helping us out. Our last staycation was at Marina Bay Sands and it was really good to just be able to go and walk around the mall that they've got there because it's huge and there's so much to do. So as it's been raining all afternoon and we did have the tennis court booked but we weren't able to go, we thought we would go and find a new shopping mall that we haven't been before and see what there is to do there. We've come to Bugis Plus, we haven't been here before. I've dropped the kids off for prawning actually but I've never really looked around as we came quite early in the morning and everything was shut. We have been around Bugis before, but not here. It's an interesting looking building. It looks quite modern, so we're looking forward to seeing what's inside. Jonty and I went to Bratislava once and we found this shop called Bershka and we really, really love it. So we were pretty happy to find those on here. Aspen's finding me some items. What have we got? Fit. Does fit. I never wear white because 
myself and the kids are just too messy, so it doesn't, uh, doesn't really work for me. Finishing off our stay staycation with some scones from Hello Scones. They're made by a really good friend of ours and they are delicious, so do look them up. They are so good. We've had a really nice time. I felt really chilled mm, and we could really sit nice. by the pool for ages until we got rained out, <laughs> which was quite fun. But um, yeah, it's been so nice actually just taking advantage and appreciating the things we do have here in the condo. Like we can just get ice cream sitting down there. Just the little things like that um, made the stay staycation even more fun. While we were out today, actually Service Hero put onto um, some of our like high frequency contact points, some antimicrobial uh, stuff, which basically puts a coating on our door handles and um, means that COVID-19 cannot live on there for the next 365 days. We hope that this has also inspired you to maybe kind of look about what you've got at home, how you can just really chill out at home, like turn your phone off, turn your work emails off, that kind of thing, and really enjoy what you've got at home and in the local area as well and things like that, yeah. Take care and we'll see you soon.